Well, we decided not to leave, and um, the, the, we had electricity until like five in the morning. So, uh, uh, but the winds, the rain started coming in. I guess around ten that night, ten eleven o'clock that night started coming in, and we just kind of hunkered down and got quiet and um, rode it out. When we woke up, it was waist deep. I really didn't think it was going to get this bad, but I stayed for Rita. So I stayed, I, I weathered Rita too. So I wasn't worried about the electricity and you know, things like that. But I just, I didn't realize the water was going to come up in the houses and stuff. But still, given the same opportunity, knowing what's happened, I still would have stayed. I would have left. Because of, you know, what everybody's going through, the ones that left, you know, they're in shelters and are separated and don't know when they can come home and when they can get back and what the damage is. And at least I know what I got to deal with. No, no, because uh, material, you know, anything material can be gained again. I'm just glad that we survived as, you know, healthy, you know, through it. I just don't believe we're going to receive the, the people in this neighborhood are not going to receive the help they need. I, I, I really don't see it happening. And because of the economic status of the majority of the people that live on this end. I don't see them getting the help that they're going to need to recover from everything that they lost.